Hi, my name is Ankita Desai. I am from Avaya Services. In this video, we will see how to do cluster reboot on Avaya Breeze platform. Topics that we are going to cover are introduction about the cluster, how to perform the reboot and a quick demo. Avaya Breeze platform restarts all the nodes in the server cluster simultaneously when you restart the cluster. Please note, the progress of the cluster reboot or the status of the cluster reboot will be available in the server administration of the Breeze element on the system manager web console. This is the procedure how to perform cluster reboot. On the Avaya system manager web console, you have to go to the Avaya Breeze element manager page. From there, you have to go to cluster administration. First of all, to reboot the cluster, the cluster needs to be in deny new service mode. After performing that, you have to reboot the cluster and once it is done, you can put the server back into accept new service mode. The status of the cluster reboot will be available in the server administration web page. Let's see a quick demo how to perform this. This is the SMGR web page where you can see under the breeze element, we have server administration. Under the server administration, you can see the list of nodes that are available respective cluster name as well as the last reboot status. In order to perform a cluster reboot, we have to go to cluster administration. This is the cluster administration. Currently it is in accepting state. In order to reboot the cluster, we have to first put it into deny new service state. So select the cluster. In the cluster state, select deny new service. It's in denying state now. Now you can select it again and perform a reboot. Depending on how many nodes you have and what all snap-ins are deployed on the system, the reboot will take time. Once the server is up, select the cluster, put it back into accept new service state. Once this is done, please make sure data replication service install status and test pass. All these checkbox are ticked as well as under the server administration. You can see the last reboot status. This will reflect the date and time when the cluster was last rebooted. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or feedback, please write us at mentoratavaya.com or on Twitter at Avaya Mentor. For more details and other technical information, please visit support.avaya.com. Thank you.